Hey Internet, for this video I'm going to solve a probability statistics problem. Consider a joint density function for x and y. f xy equals x squared times y to the third for 0 less than or equal to y less than or equal to x and 0 less than or equal to x less than or equal to 1 find the expected value of x. The given data f x y equals x squared times y to the third on 0 less than or equal to x less than or equal to 1 0 less than or equal to y less than or equal to x and everywhere else f x y is equal to 0 We are looking for the expected value of x. For density functions, we need to take the integral. So what does this density function look like on a graph? On the horizontal x-axis, it goes from 0 to 1. For the vertical axis, we are given y is less than or equal to x. What this looks like is a diagonal. So we want the density of this shaded area. This is a density function, so the expected value of x is equal to the integral from 0 to 1, double integral of 0 to x, the function times x dy dx. The reason we multiply the function of x is because we are looking for the expected value of x. If we are looking for the expected value of y, we would multiply the function with y. Because we were looking for the expected value of x, the outside integral has to be dx. We get the integral range 0 to 1 for outside integral dx because we are given 0 less than or equal to x less than or equal to 1. And the integral range 0 to x for the inside integral dy because we are given 0 is less than or equal to y less than or equal to x. Plugging in the function to the integral we get integral 0 to 1 0 to x function x squared times y to the third times x dy dx. Multiply the x with the function values and we get integral 0 to 1, 0 to x, x to the third times y to the third dy dx. Take the integral dy Treat x like a constant so nothing happens to x. Take the antiderivative of y, the antiderivative for y to the third, plus 1 to the power, so 3 plus 1 is 4, so y to the fourth. Then divide the new power over 4. 0, 2x, dx. Integral 0 to 1. Insert the x and 0 to the y's. We get x to the third times x to the fourth over 4 minus x to the third times 0 to the fourth over 4 dx. The 0 totally negates the right side. Equals integral 0 to 1 x to the seventh over 4 dx. Just like the previous add 1 to the power so 7 plus 1 is 8 then multiply the denominator with 8 so it's x to the 8 over 4 times 8 0 to 1 plug in 0 and 1 1 first 0 on the next. This equals 1 over 32. So the expected value of x is 1 over 32. And that's it. Hope this video helps. Thanks for watching.